Hey there, my friend. How you doing? It's Chris and Gia here from ChrisandGia.com. Back again with you with another very exciting episode today, all right? So, hey, what are we talking about today? Today, the question is, hey, are you trying to figure, in, trying to figure out how to convert your YouTube views into money, into profits, into your business? All right, well, today in this training, we're going to be talking about three tips on how you can convert video, your YouTube video views to money with these three video marketing strategies, all right? Quick tips, all right, that will help you get, get that profits rolling in your business, all right? So, hey, let's not waste any time. Let's get right down into it, all right? So, tip number one for converting YouTube views into money in your business is provide quality content, all right? So, whatever you, you should have a niche market that you're that you're going after whether it is you're providing tips on marketing maybe you're providing tips in health and wellness maybe you're providing tips on travel maybe you're providing tips on different affiliate programs whatever the case may be you should be providing a small piece of content and value that hosts that target audience and answers some particular question right well Chris what kind of question are they asking well that's what forms are for right you can google online forms for different niches and find out what people are asking about, what they're talking about, what they're questioning, and then go out there and answer those questions. That's it, right? And so you want to provide a solid piece of content. So it's got to be valuable. What is value? It's something that people are asking. Some people are asking questions about. It can't be just about what you have for dinner or what you think about um, the, about a movie you saw. Right? It's got to be something of value, worthwhile. It can't be just you pitching on there either, all right? You're going to have a quality piece of content, answer a question that someone is asking, provide that value and help them, all right? You do that, you get more views on your videos and more engagement on your videos, which can lead you to more money in, on your YouTube videos, all right? Step number two is get right into it, all right? So too, far too often, people will start in your videos and they say, hey, my name is, is Joe Bob and I'm from, you know, wherever and I'm doing this video because, you know, my sister told me I should. And, and there's so much, you know, all this Ford pre-story. Come on, man. People don't care, right? People don't care. You gotta remember, in this world that we live in, attention spans are like this. I saw a study the other day that, hey, humans have an attention span of like six to eight seconds now, and goldfish have like 10 seconds or something like that. So you have six to eight seconds to capture your audience's attention immediately. Right, grab them with the information and the hook that you're going to give them, and then provide that content quickly, efficiently, and eloquently. Right, because that that's how that's how the world we live in in this market. So you want to get right down into it with your YouTube videos. This is different from Facebook Live videos, where sometimes you can kind of just fiddle daddle a little bit. But to be honest with you, even on my Facebook Live vids, I get right down into it. Right, because hey. I ain't got time to waiting for people to jump on. Anyway, I'm a busy guy. I got kids, all right? <laughs> and B, people are not watching. Most people are not going to be watching those record, the actual live video anyway. People are watching the recordings mostly anyway. So it means that you just need to get right down into the content and think about that person who's watching it. So this applies for Facebook Live videos as well as YouTube videos, but especially YouTube videos. Get right down into your content. Hey, tell them, say, hey, my name is such and such. My name is Chris. I'm from Houston, Texas. And today, we're going to be talking about YouTube, converting views to YouTube, YouTube views to money, right? And then get right down into it, all right? And then tip number three for converting YouTube views into money in your business strategy, video marketing strategy, and this one's a big one, right? Is keeping your call to action simple. This one was a new one for me. Now, of course, you need a call to action. What is a call to action? It's basically telling your audience what to do after you've given them the great quality content that you've given them, right? So maybe you want to send them to a capture page that you're going to provide them with a lead magnet, more information so you can get their name, email address, and our phone number. Then maybe you can call them, engage with them, make sales that way. Or maybe afterwards you get you want to grab them and pull them into a webinar, right? Or maybe you want to provide them with a bootcamp series. You, there's so many ways you can make money, but you want to capture that information through the lead magnet, right? Then you, your call to action is important to basically saying, hey, you know, if you enjoyed this piece of information on how to get more views and convert your views, your video views, YouTube video views into money, then hey, maybe you want to check out this free 
a cheat sheet, maybe, right? Maybe this free PDF that you got, maybe this webinar, whatever it is that you're offering, right? But keeping that call to action simple. See, I used to be, I used to say, hey, you know, explain everything about what was on the next page. Oh, this is a, it's a great boot camp. You're gonna love it. It gives you this, it gives you that. You're gonna learn this, you're gonna learn that. And that's a mistake. Once again, people don't have time. Two, Something I learned is that in your marketing, in marketing, marketing is a process. I learned this from a guy, Justice Egan, I was listening to something he was saying the other day. Marketing is a process, right? So all you're doing in your marketing process is taking people to the next step. You want to get people to do the next step. You can't get people to buy, right? Buying is at the end of the, of the, of the, of the, of the game, right? You want to take them to the next step. What's the next step on your video, YouTube videos? Get them to click right? Get your, your prospect to click. Take the next step. So you will end with a call to action very simple like this. Hey, hope, hey friends, hope you enjoyed it. Hope that was valuable. If you did, hey, and you want more information on how you can get more views on your videos, then click the link below. It's going to take you a page where you can get more information on that, all right? Boom. End of story, right? And that's how I'm going to be ending mine too. So <laughs> quick call to action. You want to, your prospect to take the next step and helps with engagement, keeps your, your, your prospect curious and willing to take that next click, all right? So, hey, that's it. Those are three strategies, three tips right there that can help you convert your YouTube views into money into your business, all right? Hope that was valuable. Hope that you hope that was something that helped you in your business. Hey, if you did, hey, definitely give the video a like. Definitely subscribe to the channel so you get more trainings just like this and notified when they come out. And oh, by the way, hey, if you want to learn more about how you can get more leads and more sales engaging and prospecting on Facebook like a boss and on social media, then hey, click the link below to get to get registered for my five-day online My Social Academy Challenge. All right. So if you want more information on that, click the link below and you'll get and get, you can get check out the information on the next page. All right, so that's it, my friend. Until next time, be blessed. Stay hungry out there. I'll see you soon. Bye now.